Hi, my name is Lisa Miron, and today I want to talk to you about morphic fields. So the morphic fields are just fields of information, and sometimes we get trapped in them. And I want to do a meditation so that we're able to let go, to, so that we're able to separate and connect in a different way. So the morphic fields are fields of information. So for example, maybe we have a particular uh, circumstance in our life. Maybe I lost a child. So I start belonging to all those mothers that lost a child and I connect with their suffering. I also connect to the information of what has helped them move on and deal with the difficult situation. But since I'm also connecting to the suffering, to the pain and to the difficulties, sometimes I can feel trapped, I can be stuck. What's going on right now with the pandemic, we're connecting collectively to the fear of each other, to the uncertainty, to the pain if we're losing somebody close to us. These are all different morphic fields that we connect to. And just the fact of being aware that this is happening starts letting us relate to it in a different way. So we're going to do a meditation so that we're able to work with it. Whatever feels we're belonging to, that we feel that we're being stuck. Sometimes we may be aware of them and sometimes we don't know. So we're going to do the meditation to whatever field that we're stuck in to so be able to be free, to connect to it in a different way. So for the meditation, all you need to do is to keep your back straight and close your eyes and breathe normally and let any thoughts that come to your mind, let them go. You're going to connect with your body, with your center. going to feel connected as well with source and information coming from source from universe from love from energy from God whatever source or something greater means to you for the best possible healing of you and your family system And now you're going to think about the morphic fields that you could be trapped in. Whether you know which ones they are or not, it doesn't matter. You're going to think of everyone that has suffered the same way that you have or struggled with the same problems that you have struggled. And you're going to honor and respect all of them. Either from this moment right now or, or from, from the past. They, they also belong to this field if they were not able to deal with the situation. And now you're going to choose to connect to all of them in a different way, in a way where you're not stuck anymore. Instead of carrying the emotions from somebody else, you're gonna let go of everything that is not yours and you keep only what's yours. You're gonna connect to this field in a different way, in a way, in a way where you can share information so that something that has been useful for somebody else can connect to you and things that are useful for you to deal with this situation can connect to them and you can help each other. Always leaving with each one whatever belongs to each one, to each group of people. and you start feeling differently in your body. Lighter, you're now free. You're not trapped. Now you have a different connection. 
a connection, where there's information, where there's knowledge, when there's energy and love. And you feel all this inside of you and you say thank you. And now you're gonna breathe in deeply three times. Coming back to your body, to where you are today, right now. Feeling any, any shifts, any differences. Becoming more present. And whenever you're ready, you can open your eyes. This is it for today. I hope that this is helpful for you. Have a wonderful rest of the day or rest of the night if you're doing this in the evening. And if you want more information, you can always find information in my website, coachingandconstellations.com. Thank you very much.